Hey everybody, Mr. Frags here from ArmageddonGaming.com. This is the Dark Siders Apocalyptic difficulty walkthrough with all collectibles. So now that we got our new toy, we are going to be able to unlock some new areas. Um, what we're doing in this video is pretty much just backtracking to the initial area where we fought the Griever for the first time. Because in that area, there is um, another path we can open up with the Tremor Gauntlet that's going to take us to the end of the dungeon. Still a pretty lengthy bit to this dungeon. Uh, it's about nine videos long after this video. So there's a collectible in this area. There's one collectible. I believe it is a artifact. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to press B to grab this and then while you're pressing B or circle on the PS3 you're going to hold Y or triangle and it's going to knock it onto this platform and pretty much the use of this kind of engine block looking thing is to use it as a step to get to the upper area of this level or room. So that's how you just gotta get it across, you just gotta hold Y and bash it across. You just gotta keep moving from platform to platform. Now this second platform will raise but not much, it'll kinda jam. So you gotta jump over to the next platform and moving that one will actually lower it instead of raise it. But before we lower it, we're gonna jump off to the right over here and there's gonna be our artifact of the room and they they made it so you can't jump back for some reason I don't know why but you just gotta run around up the stairs again and just jump from platform to platform But just jump on the engine block and jump over here and lower this platform. Before it gets too low, try to jump back over here so you don't have to run around again. And then just smack this over and then head back on over to this platform again and raise it up and you'll be able to use that engine block as kind of a stepping stone. I don't know what happened there, it kind of glitched. So I guess you gotta have it completely up against the wall or it'll glitch like that. So here, these bugs are gonna get real annoying. They're not too hard to kill, just like the bats, run up to them and press B while you're under them. And it'll kill them, it's just that there's so many of them it takes so long to kill them. A little later on, when I start encountering more of them, I kind of fast forward through the sections where I just sit there and wipe out a group of them, just because it's probably tedious to watch. But every time you get a finishing move on them by pressing B like that, you do get health back. So it's kind of a free form of health. Because they're not going to do too much damage to you. Just watch out for the Griever that's kind of shoving its claws through the ceiling here. He'll do it in the same pattern every time. 
Now the one thing I like using the Tremor Gauntlet for combat for is because if you do a two button counter just by pressing Y, Y or Triangle, Triangle, it'll knock them pretty far away. And that gives you kind of the upper hand where you can dodge towards them and just unleash a little combo and just keep doing it.